your needs aren't being met. Yeah. But your sole focus is on everybody and everybody else, the economics as a whole, and, and serving humanity as a whole at the expense of meeting your own needs. But doesn't the math play out? Like if I... Well, you tell me if the math plays out. It would. If, if I'm able Not to... Not would, is it? Well, at this moment, no, but... Right. So do you want to keep exaggerating the thing that hasn't really worked out yet? Like if I keep slamming my head into the wall, like if I just slam my head less into the wall, it probably hurt less. I see what you're saying about it being my response and, you know, to, to the issue with pricing, but how can, like, you know, if, if the restaurants are overpriced and everything's tight, there's a recession, it's not going to last. You know, people aren't going to go. I'm just going to pause you right there yeah. because at the end of the day, you are the one that can fight the hardest for either your worth or your unworthiness. That there's nobody that's ever going to fight for that harder, longer, and more deeply than you. Right now, you are like knee deep in the concrete rooted in trying to prove all of the reasons why you need to receive the least amount possible in this world. It's and not possible. <laughs> listen, like I, I'm just giving you an observation. You can take it or leave it, okay. but you are fighting tooth and nail for your limitations right now. And you're welcome to do that for as long as you wish to do that. But I can guarantee you that there are people that need you to step up beyond that. And this is not just me like blowing like smoke up your butt. They have literally told you, like you've literally had people tell you this. So, you know, you're welcome to keep that going for as long as you need to keep it going. But I'm just going to leave you with the invitation to consider whether or not that has any validity for you. Well, for me, it's not about self-worth. It's about accessibility. Right. And, and who is accessible to you is in direct proportion to how much you value yourself. Mm. Like, why don't you take on, I don't know, like, why don't you go and hang out with drug addicts right now? Yeah. You, you want to be accessible. Go, go and be accessible to drug addicts. But why don't you do that? Because it just wouldn't propel me forward in any way. Because your standards are ones that yeah. don't allow that into your experience. Mm -hmm. Beyond that, your standards are such that you're willing to tolerate working for a lot less than people are willing to pay you for and have this whole slew of reasons as to why that's justified. So your tolerance for the BS of that is supremely higher than your standards for what you actually allow in. Yeah, I struggle with that. Yeah. So... And I still don't even know that. So that's why I said, and I invite you to consider that pricing is actually the biggest thing you got to solve because solving for pricing on the business side is extremely easy. You just pick a number. On the personal side of things, that's under the surface, below the iceberg, like water type of problem. Right. Mm -hmm. But that's also where all the juice is.